Hi, I'm Elijah Kionis, a teen apprentice from Canvas Credit Union, and I'm here to talk to y'all about some money saving tips for teenagers. When summer starts, like most teenagers, I often wonder how I can make some extra money with my free time. After all, it's hard to start saving money if you have no source of income to begin with. My best piece of advice is to simply get off of researching the internet and to stick with doing one thing for now. Whether it's doing yard work, picking up a part-time job, or babysitting, there are so many amazing ways to start making money. Starting something is much better than learning about a million different things, often setting unrealistic expectations for yourself. That can discourage you and prevent you from making any money in the first place. Once you get the ball rolling, it's a lot easier to build healthy spending habits and saving habits that can lead you to experiment with new ways to make money in the future. Online, we often see teenagers somehow with a lot of money to spend on the nicest clothes, cars, and shoes. Since we see this, with countless kids on social media, it could be easy to mistake having this amount of material as normal for a young teenager to have. However, this is far from what most teenagers honestly have in the real world. This is why it is important to spend your money on the things you really value, rather than what is trending on social media. For example, if you're saving money for your first car, it is important not to get caught up in random pair of trendy shoes or clothes. Once you buy the car, you'll feel even more accomplished and even more satisfied than if you wasted the money on treasure items. Don't get me wrong, it's important to spend money on a few items that you do like to build a healthy relationship, as long as those are few and far between. This will not only help you save money by spending it less, but also have you enjoy what you do have as you're not getting caught up in chasing something else. My last tip and one of my most important tips is to invest in items to help take care of what you already have. This can range from shoe cleaners to making sure your car is checked up with maintenance. There is nothing worse than being stuck on the side of the road knowing that you're going to spend $500 on your car for something that could have been prevented if you spent some time taking it to get a checkup. Along with that, taking care of your clothes and shoes shows how much you really care for the things you have and builds gratitude towards everything you have. Having a few high quality items well taken care of is always better than having a million of neglected shoes and clothes. Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope that you're able to get something useful out of it. Insured by NCUA.